At least three suspects in a brazen gun store robbery in Texas are under arrest. Surveillance video captured the elaborate break-in at the Houston store. The raid lasted about two minutes. Mark Strassman is at the crime scene as police hunt several other suspects. Mark, good morning. Good morning. The front doors have been replaced, but the crime scene tape is still up because this is where the thieves bashed their way into the gun store and grabbed dozens of weapons on Tuesday morning. Nothing subtle about this one. It's 4.30 in the morning, and a group of thieves uses a black pickup truck to rip out the front doors and smash into Carter's Country Guns and Ammo. Roughly 10 of them scatter inside, wearing hoodies, masks, and gloves, and grabbing as many guns and rifles as they could carry. It looks like they had something of a plan. You can see one suspect using a hammer to smash through the glass cases holding guns, while others follow right behind him and stuff them into bags. Another suspect seems to target the long guns right off that rack behind the counter. They took at least 50 weapons, and in a little more than two minutes, they were gone. Investigators say the group switched vehicles about a block away and took off into the darkness. This was such a rush job, police found weapons left behind lying on the street outside the store. Law enforcement officials say stolen weapons like these are often sold on the black market. Criminals buying and selling guns to other criminals. You got another criminal element that needs firearms to commit their crimes, sometimes associated with the drug trade or robberies. Investigators say there's another disturbing issue. Gun store smash and grabs are becoming more common. We're seeing an uptick not only here in the Houston, Harris County area, but we're seeing an uptick across the country. Suspects will face federal gun charges. Investigators have recovered some of the weapons and hope to get their hands on the rest before they can be used in other crimes. Charlie? Mark, thanks.